Hey everyone, it's the developer of ShiftOS here. I'm just going to show you a quick preview of the Shiftorium, which is the way you spend code points to upgrade ShiftOS. Now, a lot of people have been typing in code shop and stuff like that in 0.3, open code shop, open Shiftorium, and they're realizing that there is no actual Shiftorium, there is no code shop in 0.0.3. 0.0.4 is where you'll find the code shop. So this is just a preview of 0.0.4. Uh, I'm not very far into developing it, but here we go. Open Shiftorium. Um, this probably won't be released for a few weeks. So this is the program you're all looking for. So basically, your code points are at the bottom here. Say I've got 135 and select an upgrade on the left to view its details. So gray is the first upgrade. Um, there's going to be lots of upgrades here. This will probably be filled with about 10 upgrades here. And when you buy certain upgrades, they unlock more upgrades. So this is just going to be full of upgrades all the time to buy. And as you buy more, just more and more will be unlocked all the time. So because this is an early version, I've only got two upgrades in here, which is grey and something that will be unlocked once you buy grey. So I'll just show you quickly how it works. So it gives you the name of the upgrade here, and you can see that it costs 20 code points. Here's a description, not really of what it does, but a semi-description of the upgrade and a preview picture, so everything doesn't always have to be black and white. Give your programs and GUI some depth by mixing black and white together to form grey. Note you are unable to make controls grey until you buy the shifter. Uh, don't worry about the shifter, that won't be available till 0.0.5. Now if I click buy here, you'll see that the code points were deducted said bought for 20 code points and it'll actually and it says purchased and it'll actually give me a little bit more information here on what it was originally the screen could only display black and white but now with the ability to display grey it's easier and more efficient to display more information and controls on the screen you can now set the color of screen controls including the background to grey using shifter and even draw in grey within artpad now, the shifter is something that's going to be available in 0.0.5. It allows you to change everything, so the background colour, the window background colours, and the title bar colour, which I'll show you the title bar in a sec. Art pad you're not going to see till 0.0.7. It's basically a drawing program where you earn code points for making works of art, and you can use the shiftorium to buy new tools and new colours for it. So now that I've bought grey, you'll see that it's unlocked the title bar. And don't worry, it will unlock more things than just the title bar. And this will always be full of upgrades. Don't worry, don't think it's a... Uh, this is not going to be a linear game. You're going to be able to buy all these different upgrades in all these different orders. So next is the title bar. This is a little bit more expensive. Your windows are looking extremely bare right now. You know what they need? A grey bar on top of them. What is a grey bar for, you ask? Depending on what kind of person you are, it either does nothing or looks pretty. The title bar has a lot of future potential though. Now as you can see in this preview image, you can see what a title bar looks like at the top of the screen. So as soon as I click buy, congratulations. Windows will now have a grey 30 pixel high title bar at the top of them. It may not seem like much now, but you've just opened up the Shift OS GUI to a huge range of future upgrades that could turn this title bar into a very useful tool for window information and enhanced control. Now you may notice, oh wait a sec, where is the title bar if I just bought it? Now to update your system you just have to type in close Shiftorium or any of the programs you have open because it can't actually change a program while it's open now if I type and as you can see if I go back to the desktop with control T it's completely black shiftorium is no longer open and if I type open shiftorium you notice that shiftorium now has a grey bar at the top of it including you'll notice if I type in open knowledge input and because you haven't got multitasking, anytime you open a new program, it'll close all others. But you will be able to use the Shiftorium in 0.0.4 to unlock multitasking, then you will be able to have multiple programs open. So if I type open knowledge input, there we go. You can see the grey bar at the top and everything like that. And just remember that you may notice it's a title bar like you have in Windows, but there's no X button. There's no thing telling you that, yes, this is knowledge input. So there's no like title text and there's no nothing, no other controls on this and you can't even click and drag windows around. 
these are things that you actually have to buy in the Shiftorium. So yes, I've got a title bar, but I've got to buy a close button. I've got to buy the ability to drag windows around. I've got to buy the ability to also just display what the program is. And if you've got the shifter, which you have to buy as well, but you won't be able to buy that to a 0.0.5, you'll be able to change the height of this, the color of this, as long as you buy more colors. You might make it have a curved edge to the top here rather than a straight edge. You might make the bar appear at the bottom of the windows instead of the top of the windows. There are so many different things that you could do. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this quick preview into... Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this quick preview of the Shiftorium. See you next time with another ShiftOS dev update video when I release 0.0.4 of ShiftOS in a few weeks.